Welcome to Daily News Update. I'm Petty Officer Kat Smith, and these are your headlines from around the fleet. Rear Admiral Bill Gortney was relieved as Commander Combined Task Force 152 by the Royal Bahrain Navy in a ceremony March 4th. During Gortney's command, CTF conducted more than 300 interaction patrols, built mutual trust and respect between regional navies, and conducted bilateral exercises with coalition partners. CTF-152 is responsible for conducting maritime security operations in the Central and Persian Gulf. In the Chief of Naval Operations' most recent podcast, he spoke about the importance of diversity within the Navy. From an organization that's diverse, of many perspectives, we become stronger, we become more capable, we become more agile, and we become more effective. And at the end of the day, that's what the country wants in their Navy. The CNO added that the more diverse we are, the better we can represent our country. Find the CNO's podcast at Navy.mil. The Navy's new physical fitness uniform is scheduled to be delivered to the fleet in the spring of 2008. The uniforms will be distributed in increments over a five-month period. Uh, we will basically divide the Navy up in three increments, okay, what we call Wave 1, Wave 2, and Wave 3. Uh, wave 1 will get the uh, uniforms as soon as... Uh, we're up to production levels, and uh, we've met enough. Uh, we have enough inventory in which we can distribute to, let's say, a third of the Navy. Following that, we will move on to Wave Two, which we do the second, uh, if you will, third, and then finally the last third. Uniforms will be delivered to the fleet concentration areas first. For the Naval Media Center, I'm Petty Officer Cat Smith.